Topping our news this hour, more than a month after Yarmouth Sergeant and New Bedford native Sean Gannon was killed, we're learning more details about the investigation. All part of newly released text and audio messages that were made by the suspected killer, Thomas Satanowicz, to his ex-girlfriend moments after the deadly shooting. Julianne Lima live in the newsroom now with the latest developments. Well, Danielle and Patrick, these text and voicemail messages could become a key part of the prosecution's case against accused killer Thomas Latanowicz. In the messages, he allegedly admits to shooting and killing a cop and threatening to take down even more. Now, in the previously sealed court documents, they were released after the Cape Cod Times filed a motion to obtain them last week. They reveal what Latanowicz allegedly told his ex-girlfriend in text and voicemail messages in the moments after Sergeant Sean Gannon was murdered. You may remember, officers ultimately found found Latanowicz behind some insulation in the attic of his house. As soon as they discovered his hiding place, Latanowicz allegedly shot both Sergeant Gannon and his canine Nero in the head. That led to an hours-long standoff with police. During that time, Latanowicz allegedly called his ex and left a voicemail saying he was in trouble after shooting and killing a cop. Texts he allegedly sent after show him threatening to hurt even more officers. The first message reads, I'm taking as many as I can. He sent three other messages in the next few minutes, writing, I already shot him. I killed a cop. I shot a canine. Latanowicz allegedly then called 911, stating he wanted to talk to his ex-girlfriend. Coming up in about 30 minutes, we'll tell you the role she played in helping to end that hours-long standoff, according to these new court documents. For now, reporting live in the newsroom, I'm Julianne Lima, Eyewitness News. Well, Danielle and Patrick, the details of those messages are included in these newly released court documents. Now, these pages were recently sealed, but they were made public after the Cape Cod Times filed a motion to obtain them last week. Now, the information in these three pages could prove to be a key part of the prosecution's case against accused killer Thomas Latanowicz. Latanowicz is accused of fatally shooting Sergeant Th Sean Gannon and shooting his canine Nero in the head. According to the newly released court documents, during the standoff with police, Latanowicz called 911 and asked to speak to his ex-girlfriend. Police tracked her down and she agreed to help officers get Latanowicz to surrender. The documents show officers arrived at Latanowicz's house just before 2.30 p.m., and the standoff finally came to an end three hours later at 5.30. Latanowicz's ex-girlfriend also let police search her phone. That's where they found the voicemail message, allegedly from Latanowicz, stating he was in trouble for shooting and killing a cop. He then allegedly sent text messages to his ex. The first message reads, I'm taking as many as I can. One minute later, he texted, I already shot him, followed by, I killed a cop, I shot a canine. Latanowicz is currently being held without bail, and his next court date is June 26th. Reporting live in the newsroom, I'm Julianne Lima, Eyewitness News.